So to meet the standard um, of 1.6, it talks about integrating technology and the use of Blackboard. So I wanted to use Echo 360, which is our new lecture capture software, to give you a little tour of uh, one of my courses. So the main course that I've been teaching is NUR275601, which is Maternal Newborn Nursing. So I'm just going to go through how I have this course set up. You can see we have the course homepage, which um, has announcements and the calendar, so students know exactly at what what they need to do every day. Um, we have our Blackboard help here, our learning support that are on all courses. I have my instructor information here, so I add myself and if I'm te teaching with anyone, and my adjuncts that do clinical for my course, so they have their contact information right there. Then we have the assignment tabs at the beginning of the course I load everything so our exams um, are here our mandatory education for clinical um, discussion boards and other type of activities that they're going to need to complete through the course and they're all linked to the grade book so my students know at all times exactly where they are in the course so I have a weighted total so um, they can look after any assignment and see what their grade is so my next tab here is the course syllabus. So our syllabus is attached here. Then we have our class schedule. And some of our students have an older version of the textbook and some have a new, so I do a reading list um, for both editions of our book. Again, it has, my reading list has all the assignments on here. It has their date, um, when, when time their class is, uh, when anything's due. Um, I give reminders about homework that's going to be due the day before. So that's here. And then our next tab is course information. So this is our text. And then I have everything set up week to week. So I have a folder for each week of the course. So the students have everything they need, and I have everything I need organized in the, in the week. We have on-site clinical here on campus. So um, the materials that I need are in this folder, our mandatory activities, our math tests, YouTube videos that are added, skills checklists. Um, are there some uh, are not available to the students because uh, we go over them in class, so I make them unavailable until then. Then, uh, as you can see, we can go back to our theory. So I have a case study that's going to be due this week. I want them to begin their um, ATI assignment, so that's set up here. Then we have our clinical information. So our clinical schedule, um, their class phone tree, then I make sure that uh, they have all the policies they need related to clinical, like the student uniform guideline, makeup, their paperwork, their evaluation tool, the attendance policy, variance and remediation, um, so they know right up front, and we review all this the first day of class as well. Also on here, uh, under clinical information, is some additional stuff. These are things that are helpful to them when they go into the hospital setting, um, medications that are most commonly given, directions to the healthcare facilities, um, and patient education, common patient education that they can use as a guideline when they're doing their patient teaching with their, with their clients. And then my next tab has our course guidelines. So it has all the, the guidelines for our course, our learning objectives. The, again, the syllabus is here again, grading criteria, classroom, uniforms, academic honesty, testing policies are included. Then we have our ATI tab something that all of our nursing students do. So it's a review of the program, how they use uh, this adjunct to our teaching, and um, if they have remediation, we have codes already loaded for them here. The next one is discussion boards. We'll do a couple of discussion boards in this class. We do one on ethics, 
and one on contraception. So those are loaded here for the students to use. And then I have web links, which are helpful links. So this course has a Facebook page. We do online um, office hours before tests, so the night before exams, usually from 8 to 10 at night the night before. We'll do um, online office hours for last minute questions about test material they don't understand. Um, our students need background checks before they go to clinical, so here's a link here. They have mandatory education. There's a link here. Our, some of the courses only run well in Firefox. We have the installation there. Nurse Hawk that has the skills that we do, YouTube, and so on. So that is our course in a little nutshell. I hope you enjoyed my tour with Echo 360.